Welcome back to Lake Dardanelle for the second day of competition of the 2017 Cabela's Collegiate Bass Fishing Open. There's a ton of prizes on the line, but this event is really about the points. With the Collegiate Championship looming, the race for the Cabela's School of the Year presented by Abu Garcia is heating up. Bryan College has the lead, but Murray State has the top three spots in this event. And with double points, if they can hold on, well, there could be a change in the standings. You know, it's something I thought I'd never see. It, you know, Murray State, one, two, three, it's, it's kind of surreal, you know. Um, you don't see this very often, and we're just fortunate enough to be in this position. Getting back on the water, we'll check back with Murray State's Nick Montalino and Nick Enzio. Yeah, I think what's so cool about this area is that these fish are moving off of this main lake and heading into spawn. Using these routes, using these islands as the routes, I guess. Oh, heck yeah. I didn't even know you had one on. There we go. We broke the ice. It's a start. We're a long way from where we need to be. Oh, it's a yeah, start. for sure. We're a long, long way from where we need to be. Louisiana State's Matt Glad and Owen Richard weighed 1089 on day one, part of the 2092 total that put LSU into fifth. They're fishing shallow, flipping beavers into the brush. Earlier on in the week, and we're from southern Louisiana, so we live six foot or less. So our comfort is flipping. And earlier on in the week, we found a flipping bite. We found that these fish had moved up for the most part. Some of them we found on beds, especially the big girls that we found. So that was our game plan yesterday. It didn't change too much, even with the rain. Our first hold didn't get affected, didn't muddy up too much. Uh, today, being more post-frontal, this morning was a bluebird sky. We knew it was going to be kind of a slowdown type of thing. We figured most of them wouldn't be feeding, that it's going to be more of a reaction bite. Yes. There you go, baby. Oh, came off. Hey, that's two. Number two. I'll get me to take one. Moving on, Brock Spencer is fishing alone. His partner had emergency surgery this week, and we wish him well. But Brock paid tribute by sacking up the heaviest limit on day one. Jeez, uh, it, it was pretty crazy. Um, definitely the biggest sack I've ever caught by myself in a tournament. And uh, was, I, I didn't have anything like that in practice. I, f I found this bank up there, and there was good fish on it. but. Uh, pull up in there and you catch two big ones like that. I just boat flipped them, had no idea how big they were. So it was sort of, it was a, it was a good day. Midway through the morning on day two, things aren't going quite as well. Today I pulled up and caught two little dinks and that was it. Back on LSU's Matt Glad and Owen Richard. There it is. There we go, baby. How deep is it? 10 foot, can't pull it down. There's number three. That hurt, dude. Still need to get rid of them. You break my poles while you're at it? Uh, no, they're good. Thanks for that. I got the fish. The Cabela's Collegiate Bass Fishing Series is on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Get a good shot? Post it up. Hashtag WeAreCollegiateBass.